This is Ad Kestis Forum. Welcome to my YouTube channel. To subscribe, press the red button on the right of your screen, the grey button for notifications, in that way you know uh, when I go live uh, streaming, it, it, it notifies you. Press the thumbs up for like, the thumbs down for dislike, and always remember to leave a comment, in that way we keep the conversation very interesting and it keeps rolling. Thank you very much. In this video, you can see um a, a, a daughter-in-law by rating screaming her temper is so high raining insults upon insult threatening her grandmother uh, her mother-in-law which is her husband's mother that if she touches her she will beat her up so she was ready to beat up her mother-in-law and she's raining abuses on her mother-in-law who is obviously elderly with gray hair i would leave you to watch the videos and you hear what she's actually saying to her mother-in-law crazy it, it i'm an african woman i'm a black woman i'm proudly african and in in the african culture especially with the yorubas who will bow down and ballet for somebody who is a minute or a second older than them not to talk of somebody who is elderly not just elderly somebody who has gray hair somebody who is old enough to be your own grandmother somebody who is not just any woman but your mother-in-law the mother to your own husband you are birating you are raining you are standing tall over her head and cursing her and shouting upon her head down your own mother-in-law what really Really, really pisses me off about this this whole thing is that the her husband is standing there while her his wife is insulting her mother his mother and filming and not doing anything about it i want you to hear the the reign of abuses how she's mocking the elderly woman and cursing her and telling her that if you touch me i will beat you up you see her? You see her shouting, shouting on top of the, her mother in law's head, screaming and opening her eyes. What is so what is so demeaning about the whole thing? What is so annoying about the whole thing? Because I don't know what words I could use to best describe now because I who is watching this video and commenting on it, I'm really, really pissed. Is that there is no single ounce of respect. This daughter-in-law or so-called wife does not have respect for her own child who is caught 
an innocent child who is caught in the middle of this. She does not have respect for her husband, who is obviously telling her, O Tito, what really is so annoying about the whole thing is that he continues filming the argument and insult going, be going on between his wife and his elderly mother, who he, whom he has brought over from Nigeria to come and receive this insult. He's filming it. He is not taking his mom out of that situation to protect her because she's more of she's a vulnerable adult. Yes, she's a vulnerable adult. And then shut the bathroom door and take his mom away from that scene to another side, a peaceful room or another room in that apartment. He continues filming and watch his wife insult his mother. I know for one thing that the Yorubas are very cultural people, they are very, very traditional people. They, they, they hold their culture in a very, very high esteem. They don't play with their culture. They ballet, they bow down, they, they will rub their stomach on the floor, putting their head on your toes, buying, you know, they greet, it. They, that's how they greet, ballet. But for a daughter-in-law, to insult the, the uh, 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 her mother-in-law while she's giving her child but and the child is obviously crying and you can see her she's wearing socks and she's she's very warm clothes but the baby is baiting and and the little child is baiting and obviously cold and she's naked and she's covering herself up and she's shivering obviously it's not summer is 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 winter and she doesn't mind this. She's not even putting that child into consideration. She is still cursing and cursing and cursing her mother-in-law. You know, you know how, what you find about this. Do you do you do you think? No matter. I don't. I don't know what the the cause is. The reason why there is this heated argument and rails of insults between mother-in-law and daughter-in-law. But what I should think is that what I think is that the, her son, who is her husband and the daughter and son to this elderly lady, is so irresponsible. He should be given a backhand. He shouldn't have. What do you want? You want you you you, you what proof that you're divorcing your wife? You want fans? You want YouTube? You, you know I don't know why he's doing this. But as a responsible son, I would have thought you would have taken your mother out of that place. And taking her to a much more quieter place or put her in the car and drive out let your wife finish baiting that child dress that child up and take her to school or wherever they want to go because that child can fall ill new york i don't know where this is but this looks like this one of these chicago or new york apartments or boston apartment it looks like it i'm not sure but i know that is definitely in the usa because of the dresser in that bathroom it's, it's so sad. You pray, you pray not to have this sort of uh, a daughter-in-law. Let me, I want you to listen again, my audience. My fans, listen. And that's the child in the back. Mommy, the child is crying and they are not listening. You know, African parents need to be careful, especially when you are living abroad. This is a country that have laws concerning uh, children. They have social laws. And that child is there, the baby is crying. And you know, children, they don't know what is secret. When that child goes to school or goes to the nursery, he's going to be telling the teacher what happened at home. And they'll call the social services. And if they are not careful, they will lose custody 
of that child. A lot of uh, uh, women abroad have lost, have simply have lost custody of their children, and those children are placed in the custody of the social services, and they've been fighting to get their children back, and they cannot get their children back simply because of this sort of a situation you know if you know the sort of woman the temperament of the sort of wife you have put in the house why would you ask your mo your mother your elder elderly mother to come all the way from africa or nigeria to come and expose her to this sort of environment it is it is painful i don't i don't know what she has done no matter what she has done no matter what this your mother-in-law have done if you want to talk to your husband about it take your child out of that environment and sit down and talk to your husband and maybe go to the pastor speak, speak to a marriage counselor and and and, and sort it out yeah it is so it's so bad it is really really bad the race of is she's not scared of this woman she has no regards of her husband no regards of her child at all and he is filming you know Mommy, about that, about about that. And about that, I said. About that, about that. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. It's sad. It's so sad. Hi, guys. What do you think about this? Do you think it's the son that gave his own mother the insult? The the insult that is has been berated upon this elderly lady is more from her son than is worse than her, his own wife what do you think please leave a comment and we keep this conversation rolling thank you very much to subscribe press the red button on the right of your screen the gray button to notify you when i go live or there is a new video that have been uploaded the thumbs up for like and the thumbs down for dislike and always remember to leave a comment in that way we keep the conversation rolling thank you very much for subscribing to add this forum good day guys see you next time in my next video bye bye